What is up guys, welcome to RAM Overload. Today I'm going to show you guys how to permanently delete files from your computer and make them unable to be retrieved. So there are softwares out there where they are able to undelete files and you know if you format a disk you are still able to get that, that data back or, or at least some of it. So this way um, that I'm going to show you it will permanently delete it and it will make sure that you do not um, are you that you're not able to recover it at all so the first thing we want to check out is recycle bin you know you want to make sure you're constantly emptying your recycle bin because you know um, you guys can see if I delete this folder I open it the folder is still there all right and normally the way you would uh, let me drag that out so undelete it so it's right there normally the way you would do it would be um, like shift delete right and here I'll ask you a message are you sure you want to permanently delete this folder and most people will press yes you know and they'll think they're good but this case it does well it does give the ability to retrieve the file later on using software but it will remove it from the recycle bin so you're not able to get it back from here okay so let's just create a new file again so the other option you can do is once you delete it you can right here right click the recycle bin and click empty recycle bin and then i'll ask are you sure you want to permanently delete this file there's only one file here but if you have multiple files it'll say do you are you sure you want to permanently delete all these files and it'll tell you the size of them as well so you can do yes i'll just do no for now for the sake of this demo um, so then it will be removed from here as well right um, which uh, again it is deleted from the computer but using software you may be able to recover it and just one other option that you guys can do go right click it and go properties right you can see over here um, depending on how many hard drives you have you will see those so on my C drive you guys can see over here custom size maximum megabytes uh, 14,217 so that's the maximum file size that can be in this recycle bin and if it reaches if it goes above that it will just permanently delete it um, a more secure thing people can opt for is don't move files to recycle bin you know just remove them immediately so it will permanently delete them automatically um, if that's your case you know obviously this is more secure than custom size I do normally have this um, selected for the most part but for the sake of the demo I'll keep it here so that's the other um, way to make sure that it does get deleted. Uh, the next way is using software. This one is called the wipe file. Okay, uh, let's just undelete this file. So wipe file. So this one is basically a software used to permanently delete files. Okay, and you can see the wipe methods over here. It has a bunch of different methods and I guess how uh, extreme they are in a sense. Okay, so big bit toggle. There's Peter Gutman style, which is 35 times. Um, the file con content will be overwritten 35 times with the random and predefined data. Um, the U.S. Air Force overwritten with random characters. So this is, I guess, their standard, which you know obviously is most likely good enough right uh, but let's just stick with this one for now but you can, you guys can go through all of them um, when you guys check it out but let's put this test file here and it's really simple to use you can put a one file or you can open a whole folder right whatever you want to do you can just uh, select that easily so once you have that all you do is press wipe um, are you sure you want to delete it press mm -hmm. yes um, you know mine is really small so I happen pretty quick but basically that file is deleted forever no matter what software you use you will not be able to recover it in any way possible so yeah that's pretty much it if you guys do want your data to be permanently deleted and unrecoverable using any software I do suggest you check this out this software and the different uh, ways that I showed you guys um, if you liked the video make sure to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys next time peace